In this video, we're going to talk about which platform is the best for selling your online course. What you will learn today, what are the platforms that you have full control over is considered the best. And why you don't need to wait for payment to be dispersed to your account. And what are the rules and regulations that can get all your video removed? Every platform is a learning experience. I have tried many platforms out there, for example, Udemy, Skillshare, Teachable. All these platforms actually help me to understand the different works of the platform and what they require from the video creator. But I have one bad experience with Skillshare is that after I create videos for about two years and Skillshare suddenly one day remove all of my videos. So this happens is because Skillshare will actually change your rules every one now and then. And especially if you are a content creator that create videos with branding, they might want you to follow their rules and regulations. So this affect a lot of video creator, not just me, but a lot of video creators that have been hundreds and hundreds of videos over there uh, all got their videos removed now the reason for them to do so is that it could be they have a budget problem or it could be that your videos actually don't meet their guidelines even if you were to write in to ask for appeal they will not entertain you so what i'll say is that you can use this platform to pra practice your video creation for short courses but however do not depend on such a platform for your monthly income now you have total control means that for certain platform you have no control at all but total control means that you have control over the pricing of your course according to your expertise level now there are certain sites like udemy that which you can only set certain pricing for your course and those courses are usually low level courses which is like twenty dollars thirty dollars or hundred dollars cost you can't set a course that you can sell for five hundred dollars given the value that you can deliver is way 10 times i would say that certain courses on udemy was heavily promoted in the sense that they give out free credits or free promotion links for people or students to sign up and the number actually did blow up which does not really justify whether the course is valuable or not if you own your own content and you own your own customer list you always have the advantage of branding yourself and branding your videos understand what do you want when you create this video or your video for your niche is it to brand yourself to brand your course or is it just to monetize more video courses created doesn't mean more money this is completely true because you need to target the audience and know what the audience actually wants and does your course actually produce the result that they wanted if it does produce the result at a shorter span of time definitely you have a winning course Teachable is now my preferred choice to host all my video courses is because I could set the pricing that I want I could also write a sales copy to promote it and to route people to sign up for my course and I have total control of when I will receive the sales that's being generated from my course so in summary choose a platform which you have total control to publish your video course if you are a seasoned video producer choose a platform that you can control and always collect the student list in terms of uh, emails or your customer list so that you can contact them and upsell your next course or a revised updated version of your course. Now remarket your new course to them. This is the most important thing that you need to do. For a platform that you're on that you don't have any total control, it's for sure that the platform is marketing to them every single day on new courses or new instructor. So this is the way that they can make money. Now understand that the value you are delivering to your audience and price it reasonably because you need to understand the actual value you are going to deliver. If a cost has been priced $20, do you expect it to deliver a $100 or $10,000 value? Probably it's just a beginner cost that allows you to understand the basics and it doesn't really deliver much. A cost that you can charge more would mean that you have a step-by-step -step system, a step-by-step -step guide or follow-up system in place to help your student to achieve what they want. Now you can pre-sell your course before creating them. What I will do is that I will create the first three video to give an overall idea of what I'm going to deliver in my full course and then I'll market it to my students. So I hope that this video is useful to you. Do like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.